Hey, ¿qué onda, gente? From the Three Online, I'm Joe Rodriguez. Thanks for joining me. Yes, these bad boys right here, Las Chivas, ended up beating Toronto FC two goals to one in the first leg of the CONCACAF Champions League Finals. I'm going to show you the goals in just a second, but before I do, I want to give away this bad boy right here. This is going to belong to my good friend, Ivan, who ended up edging out Vince in a freaking crazy showdown of vote comments that I had in my video last week. So... He ended up edging out Vince, as I said, uh, it was like, I don't know, maybe like 45 to like 30 or something like that. Anyways, both of these guys sent an army of people just voting for them back and forth. It was like boop, 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 boop. Anyway, so Ivan, congratulations. You win this bad boy right here. Also, you do get a $25 gift card as well, okay? All right, so let's talk about the game. So Chivas coming into this game were the underdogs. A lot of people had Toronto picked as favorites because of their big wins over Tigres and Club America. Now, nobody expected what happened in the second minute of the game. Pizarro ends up scoring a goal and silences the Toronto crowd. Pizarro finds the back of the net, stunning everyone in Toronto. Nobody saw this coming and Chivas just like that had a one goal lead. Chivas ended up playing really, really well for the first 15 minutes of the game. You saw the field completely opened up. They had a lot of good movements. They had some opportunities. But in the 18 minutes, a defensive collapse ended up giving the Canadian side a goal back. So now the game ended up being tied. You can see right here, the Chivas defender not tracking the Toronto player. And it's Osorio who ends up scoring for Toronto FC. And then things end up tied up. Now the rest of the first half ended up favoring Toronto a little bit more they put a lot more pressure on Chivas. They had a couple of attempts, and it appears though for a second that Chivas was just falling apart. However, at the end of the first half, it was one apiece. In the second half, it looks like Chivas regained their composure just a little bit. Matias Almeida ended up making a couple of adjustments, and then Chivas, when they needed to, seized the moment. It was Alan Pulido on the free kick that was meant to be more like a cross, he ends up scoring the goal. He gives Chivas a two to one lead. Now Chivas is in control of the game. Toronto has to send everybody up front. So now Toronto's scrambling, trying to find a goal. You know, they had a couple of attempts here and there, but Chivas ended up playing very, very good. Almeida made the proper adjustments when he needed to make them. He made the substitutions when he needed to make them. And at the end of the day, Toronto FC just couldn't score anymore. Chivas goes into Toronto ends up coming up with a huge 2-1 victory on the road. Now the next game will be played in Guadalajara next Wednesday. So like I said, Toronto FC now down two goals to one are gonna have a very tough task ahead of them. They're gonna have to go down to Mexico and beat Chivas in Guadalajara. I'm not saying that it can't be done, but it's gonna be really tough. They're gonna have to send everybody up front and on any given counter attack, Chivas could score one, two, three, the floodgates could open up and before you know it, it's over. However, both of these two teams will meet again next Wednesday. All right, so just to show you that I'm not a thousand percent Chivas homer, I do have this to give away. This is a Toronto FC authentic jersey, all right? It has got the patches and everything, all that good stuff. So here's what I'm gonna do. If you wanna win this bad boy to enter for a chance to win it, you're gonna have to subscribe to my channel, which I know most of you guys do already. Also, make sure you comment on this video or any of my Champions League videos. Hashtag Toronto FC ETO. And I'm going to announce the winner after next week's final. All right? So that does it for me. Thank you very much for tuning in. Till next time, peace out.